the first time we take you to the Mathura. So, as Commissioner Fasten your seatbelts, kids, we request you to be silent. So, there are kids on the stage and adults. So, if we request everybody to be silent, so they can focus on their acting. And then again, kids who are in the front, we request you to stay little behind because there are people and things they will fall from the stage. So you will get hurt. So please stay a little away from the stage. Hare Krishna. As soon as I arrive in Vrindavan, I will have darshan of the lotus feet. And all the sinful reactions will be destroyed. Small boys, 
What do they know about wrestling? They fight with their cohort friends as part of their daily play. How can they take part in the wrestling match? I cannot allow them to go to a big city such as Madura. Yes, my Kiana's hands and legs are soft like butter. He gets so busy playing that he forgets to eat. So I have to run behind him to feed him butter and other footsteps. How will he take care of himself in Mathura? I will not allow him to go to such a big city. You do not need to worry at all. I will personally take care of their well-being. And I will always be with them to ensure that they are well taken care of. Baba, we want to go and see the wrestling match. We have never seen such a big city like Mathura. Please, give us your permission to go. Yes, Baba. I want to see Lord Shiva's home. Please allow us to go. I'm eager to witness the sacred rituals of the Dhanuriya here in Mathura. Yes! I also want to go and see the big buildings in Matar. I have heard that the marketplace is huge. I want to see it. Yes, I have heard that every house is decorated with flowers. The whole city will be filled with so many festivities. I would really like to go and see. Yes, I've heard. There are so many nice and tasty sweets that are not found in Vrindavan. <laughs> Friends, let's not miss this wonderful opportunity to explore Mathura's rich history and vibrant culture. I'm very eager to witness the fierce competition among all in Mathura. Baba, you and other common men can also come with us. How will I live without you, Krishna? I cannot stay without seeing you, even for a moment. Maya. It is just a matter of a few days. Also, Baba and other coward men can also come with us. So please, do not worry. Yes, I will personally take care of everyone. And they will return in a few days after the Dhanuriya is over. Mathura to 
होते कृष्ण एंड बलराम इंसान दोनों ही अज्ञा है अपने लिए मथुर He saw both the Lord 
was in the water, and it was completely bewildered to see them. How are the two lords present in the water? I just saw them seated in the chariot. Let me go and see. Look, look, isn't the same Krishna about whom we have 
silk 
cloth embedded with jewels, and he offered them cloth armlets, bracelets, and earrings that looked just like jewels, just suitable to their bodily complexions. Pleased with the weaver, the Lord blessed him. I am so pleased with your service. I give you the benediction that after you leave this body, you will achieve the Sarupyamukti. And while living in this world, you will enjoy all the material opulences and physical strength. Thank you. 
the sandalwood bowl. I think you should offer the sandalwood to me. And if you do that, I will assure that you will have a great fortune. Why are you making fun of me? Don't you have pity on me? As it is, because of my disfigured body, everyone calls me Triba. And now, you are also teasing me. Whatever I said is true. Your soul is the most beautiful. And hence, I call you Beautiful One. I am a menial servant of King Kamsa and every day I make the sandalwood bulb for the king. However, after seeing you, I have realized there is no one else who can be better served with the sandalwood bulb other than you two. So please allow me to apply this on you. started applying the sandalwood pulp on Krishna and Balaram. Lord Sri Krishna was pleased by her service, as he is pleased by transcendental loving devotional service of his devotees, and he was thinking how to reciprocate with her. So he pressed down on her toes with both his feet and placed one upward pointing finger of his right hand under her chin and straightened her. Good 
of the soldiers and took the bow in his left hand. After stringing the bow, he drew the string back and it broke into two parts. Everyone present there was struck with wonder, witnessing the strength of Lord Shri Krishna, and they all glorified the Lord. The sound of the cracking of the bow filled both the sky and the land. Thank you. 
so many years, especially my father and mother. Ha! You will soon realize that you cannot escape the fate that awaits you at the hands of Kamsa. Some 